Today on Do It Yourself Ken, we're going to be working on a 1997 Toyota Camry. So the problem that we're having is that our driver's side radiator fan isn't working. Um, initially the fan was making a loud noise, but now it just stopped working. So what we're going to do is replace it. So for this job, you're going to need a ratchet with a 10 millimeter socket and an extension. Um, and you're going to need your new uh, radiator fan assembly. So with the old fan, what we found the problem was is that there was something wrong with the motor. Um, but when we checked uh, to try and buy a new motor, it was about the same price as the whole thing. So we just got the whole assembly. So to remove our driver's side radiator fan, we're going to need to remove our uh, passenger side radiator fan. So first you want to disconnect disconnect it. Next you're going to use your ratchet with the 10 millimeter socket to loosen your bolts up. Now we're going to loosen the second bolt here. And now to remove the fan, we're just going to move this hose out the way and lift up. So now we're going to remove our driver's side fan. First we're going to disconnect it. Now we're going to remove the two bolts, one, two. Now, I'm going to have to lift up on this a little bit and then just kind of wiggle it out. So now we're going to install our new driver side radiator fan. Um, one thing to keep in mind is that these spokes on the new fan, one and two, are going to go into here, one and two. So we're going to slide a radiator fan into the passenger side, and then we're going to wiggle it in, and just make sure that it goes into those. Into those holes. There you go. So now with the fan in place, um, we're gonna play, uh, put our bolts back in. Um, just if you want, you could go underneath the car and make sure that those uh, spokes are inside the hole. Um, that's what we just did. So everything is in place. Now we're just gonna screw this in. Just gonna use our ratchet with the 10 millimeter socket to tie these back up. Last thing you want to do is just make sure you reinstall your connection. So to reinstall the uh, passenger side radiator fan, you want to make sure the spokes go into these holes here. One and two. So now we're gonna reinstall our passenger side radiator fan. Move the holes out the way. Make sure you drop it more or less into place. Now we're going to uh, put our bolts into place. We're going to tighten these up with our 10 millimeter socket. You don't really need the extension. Nice thing you want to do is just reconnect it. So now with our new driver side radiator fan, installed you can see everything is working properly so that's how you replace a radiator fan on a 1997 toyota camry hope you found this video helpful save time and stress working on this car by subscribing to the channel or clicking the playlist link below take care